minutes to go back there and make sure the bastard's dead. Move, Lieutenant Baird. are denied any right to an attorney and may not question the authority of this tribunal. So we can't ask why you're doing this now. At the conclusion of this tribunal, I will issue a fair and swift verdict. Right. Of course you will. Colonel, are we being charged with doing our job? The charges will be defined as I hear your testimony. Now, Lieutenant Baird, begin with the last time we saw each other. Our mission was to rendezvous with a supply convoy. But then, things started to go wrong. How exactly did things go wrong, Lieutenant? Gradually, sir. And then... for a few days. We'd seen some action, but nothing like... Um, you know. Nothing like what, Lieutenant? Nothing like Karn, sir. as fast as we could, sir. There was no saving that convoy. I'd heard other units talk about the glowing wretches, but I thought that was just soldiers telling stories. Turns out it's not. Our old convoy had been wiped out in minutes. Never seen anything like it.
There was half a company here. died. They exploded like they'd been drinking out of a fuel tank. I hoped we wouldn't be seeing them again anytime soon. Colonel Loomis, this is Lieutenant Baird. Big problem, sir. Our convoy just got destroyed. Then move on to the Museum of Military Glory. It's under attack. Sir, whatever destroyed our convoy still out there. Noted, Lieutenant. Yes, sir. Come on, Kilo. You heard the man. I heard him. Doesn't mean I like him. The museum was on the other side of the river, the side the cod no longer controlled. I thought maybe we could slip through unnoticed. Hmm, nice. This would make a fine UIR headquarters. Yeah, don't go fill in your canteen, Paddock. So this is the UIR sniper rifle. This isn't a gun! It's a comrade. Turned out that someone had designated the old town a Hammer of Dawn free fire zone. With our radios down, all we could do was rush through as fast as possible.
Piece of advice. Stay out of the light. Ooh. 